Maybe you would like to give me a clue? Maybe you would like to try harder? <laughs> I never try. Ask you to try like going uh, toilet. <laughs> Hello everyone. Welcome to Battle of Mother Tongues. Where we test Singaporeans on how good their Tamil, Chinese and Malay is. Just a friendly competition to appreciate each other's language and culture. Today's topic is Tamil history and heritage. Are you ready? Bangge. What is your mother tongue? Tamil, Malayalam, Tamil. Chinese. Chinese. Malay. Malay. How would you rate your Malay language skills? Not that good. I won't say very good. Proficient. Now, why I ask this is because today I'm going to be asking you some questions to test your Tamil proficiency. Okay. Ah. <laughs> Maybe. Awesome. Yeah. You don't seem very happy. Awesome. Yay. Let's do it. So, okay. Lah. I give you extra motivation, extra awesome. energy. Okay. You will get these. <laughs> Mula. Thank you. If you answer my things. Yeah. It's real. Love it. Yes, <laughs> of course it's real. Cash money to motivate you a little bit. Got some money over here. Ah. Now you have five questions. Two questions will be easy and they are worth ten dollars each. Two questions will be medium level, worth forty dollars each. Okay. And one question difficult for a hundred and fifty dollars. Wow. Now if you answer all five questions, you will get two hundred fifty dollars. But because you're really good in your mother tongue. We okay. will throw in an extra fifty dollars as bonus, so in total, you will get three hundred dollars awesome. if you're able to answer all five questions. Uh, very nice. Are you ready? Let's do it. No. Okay, you go ahead and ask. I hope I know. <laughs> yes. And today's questions are based on Tamil history and heritage. Now, your first question for ten dollars is: What is the word for unique in Tamil? Unique. Unique. Hey, Rajini, can't talk about you now. Unique. Oh no! Unique, unique, unique. Um, some people who don't know Tamil will say unique, so I'll, they will use like that, lah. You are a unique person. Thank you. Wasn't a compliment. Oh sorry. Uh... <laughs> Hello. Answer the question. What yeah, is yeah. unique in Tamil? Oh. Tanit tuvam. Are you very sure? Oh, are you sure somehow? <laughs> Lock in. Tanit tuvam. Not bad. Okay. 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 Okay.
கோவில் ஃபைனல் ஆன்சர் ஃபைனல் ஆன்சர் தி வேர்ட் ஐ வாஸ் லுக்கிங் ஃபார் வாஸ் ஆலயம் ஆலயம் அண்ட் கோவில் ஓ மை காட் ஷி காட் மீ தேர் காட் ஹியர் யூ 10 dollars what is the word for temple in mandarin Maybe you can try to zao qu with it and see whether it makes sense. 我对面的安迪啊，每天初一十五都去寺庙拜拜。哎, hey, okay. And congratulations, your answer is correct. Good job. This is easier than the first one, lah. Some new, new. Special. Something miao ah cannot be right. Uh, is there something miao or miao something? Maybe since you have the word miao, maybe. Oh, miao tang. Okay, think about it. Ah, tang is what? Sweet. <laughs> Your final answer is Miao. And Miao is the correct answer. Congratulations. For another $10. What is the word for temple in Malay? Temple. Masjid I know ah. Bangunan sembahyang. I really don't know. I'm just okay. going to go with bangunan sembahyang. Okay. That is not correct. I think you just temple. Is it? Stop temple. Then you say lah. I know there's another word for it. My chick got say before. Okay. But okay. I cannot remember. Can you try and remember her voice? It's been four years. <laughs> temple lah. I think pretty sure is it? temple. Okay. So your answer is? Temple. And your answer is incorrect. We were looking for quill. Oh, you're yeah, quill. Huh? Yeah, 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 Okay, $5. Uh, I don't have, sorry. <laughs> Now, to give you some context for the word temple, the Sri Mariamman Temple was not only a religious place, but also a beacon of the Hindu community in Singapore. The temple provided shelter to new settlers until they found work and moved on to their permanent home. And it also functioned as a social place where traditional ceremonies like weddings and cultural events were held. We are now moving on to the medium level questions. Your first medium level question question for $40 is what is the word for literature in tamil literature literature is a brilliant word honestly it's a very tough word of course i don't know why you put in the medium maybe you would like to give me a clue maybe you would like to try harder <laughs> <sighs> try i never try ask you to try like going uh, toilet <laughs> literature, literature. It's a, this is a hard one oh no <laughs> tamil yeru se e oh Ilakiam. Are you sure? Why well, you very poker face, you know? <laughs> I think I'm sure, yeah. Ilakiam. Unfortunately, Ilakiam happens to be the right answer. <laughs> no way. Yes. It okay. Yes. <laughs> Kavide, but that's poem. Cannot be. Starting letter is. Starting letter is cannot tell you, oh. but I will tell you the ending letter. Im. Im. Im, guys. <laughs> Im. Starts with E. E. Ilakiam. Ah, easy lah, ilakiam. Okay, what's the word for literature in Tamil? Ilakiam. You got it right. Forty dollars. For forty dollars, what is the word for literature in Mandarin? Literature. 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 Is 文学嘛？应该是不是？文学。Stand your final answer. 文学就是文学，应应该也不是算文学。Starting to self doubt herself. <laughs> 应该是文学了。文学啊啊啊 ！All right. 文学 is the correct answer. Congratulations. 是什么学的 ？It could be. 历学，文学。Final answer is 文学吧。文学 is the correct answer. Congratulations. What? <laughs> for forty dollars, what is the Malay word for literature? We're talking about like the subject or yeah, like yeah. the pembelajaran buku. <laughs> no. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna get it, lah. Yeah. Okay, your answer is <laughs> pembelajaran buku. Okay, and your answer is wrong. Karangan. Go hit those kumpu. Oh, we're so bad. Do you know Hina? That's Vanessa. Can Google. Hina cannot. Okay, any answers? No answers. Really don't have. Okay, the answer is sastra. Sastra. Oh, 
I've never heard never of it. Never take sastra. Now, why the word literature is because Tamil literature is one of the oldest and richest literary traditions in the world, dating back over two millennia. It encompasses a wide range of genres and forms, reflecting the diverse cultural, religious, and social influences of Tamil-speaking region. Next medium-level question for forty dollars is: Can you explain the following Tamil phrase? Panei maratin mudal talir. Adan veeril ulladu. Okay, 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 okay. Maram Tanir. Mathematical calculation going on is it now? I know the palm tree in the beginning. The last part is the root. I don't know the middle part. Okay, Tanir means sprout. So, which means it grows from the bottom up. So, you need a good strong foundation or something like this. So, what's your final answer? A strong foundation is very important. And Anil, I must say you were close. A tree sprout is in the root. Oh. It's not hanging in the tree. What are you doing? This all trees sprout. Ah. Uh -huh. You would think it's there, but what you are saying, it's not there. It's here. It's in the root. So you must dig and take. So don't look at the wrong direction in life. Sometimes you must change your perspective and find what you need. That's your final answer. Unfortunately, yes. I cannot give you the forty dollars. But you can give me twenty dollars. No. Now the phrase translates to the first sprout of a palm tree is in its root, which implies that the beginning of something significant, such as knowledge or success, can be traced back to its foundation of fundamental principles. For forty dollars, can you please explain the meaning of this Chinese idiom "wen yi zai dao" over here? Mm. Wow. I didn't even know. I never heard this word before. <laughs> oh. That means your words can be combined together. Okay. The Chinese word can be combined together and get. <laughs> she was very confident just now when she was about to say out the answer, and then she sat halfway, halfway like. <laughs> I really never see these four words. Ah, uh. it's okay. I just guessing, guess, guess. Ah, yeah. uh, just guess. Think. All the words can be combined together. So, is that your final answer? Yes. And the answer is unfortunately wrong. When you say that, oh my gosh, the language arrived. <laughs> so, what is your final answer? <laughs> I'm sorry, language arrived. <laughs> and the answer is. Wrong, unfortunately. So the idiom actually translates to morals expressed in words, which emphasizes using text to convey the truth and moral principles as a form of philosophy and teaching. For forty dollars, can you explain the meaning of the Malay phrase "bahasa jiwa bangsa"? Bahasa jiwa bangsa. Ah, mm. uh, means. Uh... Eh. Don't send her the video. It's something we didn't got to do with our like culture, our race. Okay. You know? like, Malayu. Yeah, yeah, Malay. Okay. Malay people in Malay language. <laughs> and then what happens? Um, strong, strong connection. <laughs> <laughs> Together in one language, you are different like race, but then you speak the same language, so then you understand each other, and then you are like. Friends. This time you're quite confident. Yeah. Really? Yeah. That is not correct. <laughs> you know your language and your culture. So basically, you're proud to be your bangsa lah. You're proud to be your race okay. and your language. Okay. So you embrace. Your answer is not as accurate as we wanted it to be. So the phrase actually translates to "language is the soul of the nation" in English, which emphasizes the significance of language in preserving the cultural identity, heritage, and unity of a nation. Now we move on to the difficult level for one hundred and fifty dollars. You have two minutes to translate an English passage to your mother tongue on the iPad provided. Your sentence has to be grammatically and structurally correct. And after the two minutes is up, you need to read. To the audience, what you have written. Here's your passage, and your two minutes starts now. Hindu temples are famous for their beautiful architecture and lively festivals. They often have detailed carvings and spacious ground. Translate. Don't look at me. First up, translate. He looks like he's going to start a Bharatanatyam dance any moment. <laughs> Why got dancing all involved? Ayo, my brain is like that. <laughs> just try your best. Just try your best. Let's see what. What do we see? Ah, I don't know. I'm stuck. 
இந்து கோவில்கள் அவர்களுடைய ஹிந்து கோயில்களில் உள்ள சிற்பங்களும் கொண்டாட்டங்களும் எல்லாருக்கும் தெரியும் செம்மையா இருக்கும் செம்மையா இருக்கும் I am encouraging the youth to go to the temple. I can't say uh, very complicated uh, words. No one has to encourage youth to go to the temple. I am or. like that. You need to encourage people this to is, even speak language properly. This is beyond money. This oh. is about my responsibility yes. as a citizen of Singapore. <laughs> I think that deserves money. In the Kovil Galin, Aragiya Kattada Amaipu Miga Brahmanda Maga Ullana. You tried. You did tried, your yeah. best. Although it's not the right word. were looking for so let me read it out to you awesome. hindu koyilgal alagiya kattida kalai mattum brahmandamana thiruvilakkalukku pugal petrave nunukkamana sirpangalaiyum visalamana alladhu paranda idangalaiyum koyilgal kondullana all right can you please read out what you have written down here hindu si miao zui chuo ming de shi jian zhu de mei he zhi xi de diao ke hai you guang da de yan di gei qing zhu de yong chu your answer is ஒரு <laughs> Face. Proud. I'm very proud. <laughs> of me. Of how you murdered Tamil, is it? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, now for the prize presentation. You have two easy questions, correct? And that is $20. And you have one medium question, correct? And that is $40. Congratulations. Two easy questions. And that is $20. One medium question, correct? And that is $40. One easy question. And that's $10 for you. Thank you. One easy question for $10. Yay. Okay, and then you had a uh, one medium question where you were very very close just now. So a consolation $10 for you. Okay, thank you so much. Yes. Yay. You managed to answer two easy questions. So you win $20. One medium level question $40. Wow. Two easy questions and that's $20. One medium level question. So that's $40. Now I can take a grab premium. <laughs> you need grab premium for now you one person grab on enough ah <laughs> awesome thank you, you mean, so much wait 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 you mean your shoulders cannot fit into normal cars right? i guess it's it that means have a lovely day and that's it for the final episode of battle of mother tongues it has been so much fun testing singaporeans on their mother tongues and learning about each other's cultures we want to see your thoughts on the series in the comment section and if you had fun watching smash the like button and share it with everyone we hope you've learned some new words in malay tamil and chinese so do let us know if you want more thank you for watching battle of mother tongues bye Hey. Ha. Fuck it.